The job-related use of mobile devices at home, outside working hours, increases the perception of individual productivity. But it comes at a cost in terms of individual well-being and quality of family life. In a paper with Manjua Uja and Chiara Trombini, we found that heavy usage of mobile devices for work purposes at home can lead to an increase in self-perceived productivity, but also in stress-related level of somatic symptoms and need for recovery. This is further amplified when workers' organizational environment is competitive. We involved more than 300 workers in the United States and their live-in partners. Participants were asked to complete two surveys two weeks apart. The first measured the extent of conflict between family and work commitments, as well as how competitive their workplace was. The second survey asked about their productivity, where they had experienced any somatic symptoms, their need for recovery, and whether they had been unpleasant to their family. At the same time, their partners fill out a single survey about participants' mobile phone use for work-related activities outside working hours. Family work conflict originates from the incompatibility of responsibility for family and work, because these two domains are characterized by different demands in terms of expectations and commitments. Individuals have to make trade-offs in allocating time and energy because they have a limited pool of resources. Individuals tend to show off their availability and willingness for work when they perceive an organizational competitive climate. While these employees report significant improved productivity, they also tend to suffer from stress-related physiological symptoms, like headaches, and they report higher need for recovery. Unfortunately, they are also more abrasive at home. Our findings could serve to raise awareness on the importance of being able and conscious about managing boundaries between work and personal life. Well-being and responsible use of technology can be traced back to individuals' behavior and organizational culture, and the right to disconnect should be respected.